When studying rare or elusive species, alternative methods are necessary to sufficiently monitor populations. Non-invasive genetic sampling of animal tissues provides a valuable source of DNA, allowing biologists to collect critical data without handling, capturing, or even observing animals. This non-invasive method has become especially important for researching the endangered or threatened species such as caribou, as it poses little to no stress on the animal under study. Once fecal pellet samples are located, clearly labeled sterilized sample bags are used to collect fecal samples, and sterile disposable tongue depressors are used to scoot samples into sample bags along with snow when available. Researchers collect samples approximately one and a half times the number of suspected animals to have visited the site. After which time, samples are moved to freezers where they are kept frozen at minus 20 degrees Celsius until DNA extraction occurs in the lab. Locating these sample sites begin by flying a helicopter or fixed-wing aircraft over flight lines determined as high-quality caribou habitat. Local weather conditions such as snow depth, wind speeds, and cloud cover determine whether sample collections take place on any given day. Researchers rely on a visual identification of caribou or their cratering sites to choose where to land. This method has increased in popularity over the years as it has proven to be a viable tool for monitoring and studying woodland caribou populations.